day. And recently we had a client that said she, she buys tons of bananas and she has having an overabundance of bananas even after she froze them for her shakes and etc. And she asked me what is a good healthy banana bread recipe that I can make so that all those bananas, they, they don't go to waste. Well, one thing is, in my kitchen, no type of bread, no type of banana bread, blueberry bread is ever allowed during the week because you can still overdo it on portion size. Here's my solution. It's a recipe that I use often when I was competing. I practically lived off of these things. It's banana protein pancakes. So what we have here, this is going to be for one serving size as well. So what we have here is a half a cup, actually a little bit more because I'm going to give them to my wonderful hubby, of um, oatmeal, quick cooking oatmeal, so that you want to make sure it's quick cooking flakes so that it can absorb the moisture from your egg whites. And the brand I like is right here, McCann's. It's delicious. I love the texture. You can find this at Rouse's. All this stuff can be found at Rouse's. Then we have one whole mashed up banana, super ripe, so it's going to be a little sweeter. And then right here we have six egg whites separated. Now you can have a yolk, the yolks are not bad, but um, sometimes we like to add a little bit of natural almond butter or peanut butter to our pancakes. So that's what we choose to have as our fat. We also, we're gonna add some cinnamon, pumpkin pie spice, vanilla, a little bit of sea salt, and then your stevia for your sweetener. So here we go, let's go ahead and combine the ingredients. Go ahead and get that mixed up because you want that to start absorbing the moisture wide. Very important for the egg whites. I always buy organic. And however, we just found this wonderful guy in Folsom that does free range organic eggs as well. So um, I'll get you both of those names. But again, these can be found at Rouse's. Very convenient. I have to praise you. Then for the banana. Then let's go ahead to our spices. Now, the recipe will call for about a half a tablespoon, but I love cinnamon, I love pumpkin spice, so I just kind of put it in there as much as I want. Okay, and you can do the same. And that's the great thing about this recipe is that it is so versatile. A little bit of um, organic vanilla extract, the good stuff. Love it. And then just, just a dash of salt to balance out your sweetness and the stevia that we're about to add. Okay, and then it's a, usually use a little scoop. I'm just going to kind of pour it in there because I've made this recipe so much, I can practically do it in my sleep. Up. Okay, it doesn't look terribly appetizing right now, does it? But I promise you, it will form into something good. These may take a little practice for you, but watch my video and just follow the steps and they should come out delicious. Now after we've mixed it all up, we do want to let it sit for about 5 to 10 minutes before you cook it. So it's been about 5 minutes now and as you can see, the mixture has thickened drastically. Um, if you wait just a few more minutes, you could, you'll see that it'll be even a little thicker, um, but I'm impatient. So let's go ahead and we're going to pour about half a cup onto the griddle, which I uh, preheated and I sprayed with this uh, pan. I have to praise you. Now, it's not like a regular pancake, so you're not really going to see it bubbling right away of gotta follow your intuition. Don't overcook it. You want these to stay nice and moist and um, because they are cleaner and they are um, essentially fat free, um, they will dry out very easily. So just keep a close eye on them. Don't walk away. So they, it took about five to eight minutes to cook on each side. And as you see, they're lightly golden brown now. The um, thicker the mixture is, a little longer that it'll take. If you cook it right away and you don't let it sit, you'll probably be able to flip it right away. It just depends how you like it. So here it is, delicious, ready to go, totally complete. Oatmeal, egg whites, bananas, everything all in one meal.